Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate 2 Enhanced Edition with me, Bring It Down. If Let's go wish. talk to Quail for Aerie. Yes? Uncle Quail, it's good to see you again. Is is everything alright? You sent somebody to ask me to come. Aerie, it's always good to see you. And yes, I did ask you to come. With Donald and his friends, I think you can help me. Or one of my friends, rather. I'd be happy to. Uh, which friend are you talking about? I know what you know of, my dear. The last I met in my earlier days, when I happened to find myself in the Outer Plains. That's a long story I won't get into. She's here in Othkatla, and has herself in a bit of a bind. She wrote me a letter asking for my help, but you and Donald may be able to help more than I. I'd be happy to help her, Uncle Quail. That is, if Donald thinks we have the time. What, what do you think, Donald? It wouldn't hurt to see if we can help out. There's no rush on such a thing. If you find the time, her name is Ryla Shy. She'll be found at the playhouse beneath the Five Flagons Inn in the Bridge District. If you can't help her, well then you can't help her. But Ryla's is a dear heart, and it would do an old gnome's heart good if you could try. I'm sure we can find some time to at least speak to her, Uncle Quail. I hope so. It's been good to see you again, dear one. Be safe. Yes. Okay. Nope. Oh. Uh, we said yeah. there's no rush, so... I'm not going to rush. It is done. We're going to go to the Copper Cornet. As I thought. And finally finish exploring it. And taking care of the quest there. If you wish. Hopefully we don't get interrupted again like we did last episode. Gather your party before venturing forth. Out with it. If you wish. Yeah, yeah. I got some cheap beer for ya. Alright, see what all we have to sell. Battle axe. Hold on to the dagger. Speaking of bolts, he can probably, yeah. I call he has room for that. What? And there's something else. Oh, yeah. Hmm. It is done. How many items does he have? Because I do want to read all the flavor text for all the unique items, because I like... I like flavor text. You will find no better prices in arm. I guarantee it. All right, he has quite a bit. We're not going to read that right now. Huh? So my intent is... Simple. To not buy any of these expensive, unique items yet. Uh, once I leave Othkatla, I'll probably stop and purchase some stuff. Uh, there is one that I'm going to need before I even leave Othkatla, though. That uh, Deidre has. Out with it, if you wish. Back at the Adventurer's Mart. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Eddie, citizen. Uh, you're welcome to enjoy the exclusive entertainments offered by the Copper Cornet. Feel free to look around. It is done. Thank you for wasting my time giving me permission. As I thought. Simple. Let's so just open the darn door. If you there we wish. Go. The layout in here is. I. I have been looking at the scars on my back, the stumps that were, that were once my wings. They do not. They do not make me truly homely, do they? Am I? Am I ugly to you? Yes. Yes, you are. No, ah, uh, let's see. I take far more than a couple of scars to hide all the other beauty you possess, Aerie. Really? You are very kind to say so, Donald. I... I suppose I am too proud that I miss my white wings so. When I was first enslaved, I was kept in a small cage and put on display. I had no room to stand, much less to stretch my wings. I... I tried to warn my captor. I pleaded to him. But my wings withered and became bloody and diseased. Until finally, he was forced to... to saw them off. 
It was it was so painful and horrid. <clears throat> I'm not tearing up, I just had something in my throat. <laughs> I felt like a great part of me has been missing ever since. I am incomplete. I do not feel beautiful, Donald. Not anymore. You place too much of yourself in your wings, Aerie. You have to look at the rest of yourself and find beauty in that, too. It is very hard for me. I shall try to think as you say. I thank you for your kind words. Yes. Uh, out with it, if you wish. Uh. Frankie. Why, hello to you, dear customers. Welcome to the pit. The pit? You have animal fights back here, too, then? Better than that. We have the very best in live entertainment. Actual combat between man and beast, presented for your viewing pleasure. Combat between men, is it? Such a practice is vile, Donald. Surely we will not stand idly and allow such practices to continue. They watch people fight each other. Sorry, they watch people fight each other here? For pleasure? Why would they why would they do that? Those men. They don't do that willingly, do they? Witness is the Cornet's own gladiators fight for their lives in the pit. Feel free to join the nobles in the viewing balcony above, my lord. Gladiators? There are people willing to risk their lives in this pit of yours? Willing or unwilling, it makes little difference. The gladiators fight to amuse our clientele. I'm sure you'll agree they put on an excellent show. You mean that they're slaves? Slavery is such a harsh word, my lord. Here we think of them as purchased employees, an excellent source of entertainment. Go on in and witness it for yourself. Isn't slavery and this sort of barbaris barbarism illegal? The legalities are such a technicality. The amusements are here for your enjoyment. Let Ledinen and his staff worry about such matters as legality. So, you're saying there are fighters willing to risk their lives for the sake of entertainment? Oh, okay. And yeah, when is the next fight? I understand there is a match ready, ready to be underway very soon. Go on in, my lord, and see for yourself. I'll be on my way then. As you wish, my lord. Enjoy. What? Yeah, yeah. Hmm. It is done. As I thought. Simple. If you wish. Uh. If I may have your attention once again, gentle folk of Athkatla, Leitenan is proud to provide for your amusement once again. Bring your attention to the pit as we see two combatants fighting for their very lives. I trust all bets have been placed. Very well. Begin. I will not fight. This is inhuman. How can you suffer this to continue? How can you? <laughs> you will fight because you are a slave and you have been told to fight. Refuse and be devoured for the amusement of our guests. They're going to... They're going to make him fight a wild animal. Oh no. I don't think I can watch this. It's horrible. Oh, and it's a troll too. Yeah, that guy's got no chance. So I highly doubt he has a way to apply fire damage to the troll. Huh? Out with it, well, if you wish. We may not approve of it, but I am gonna profit off of it. Uh, I got a dagger I can yeah, sell. Yeah. Hmm. It is done. As I thought simple. Right. If you uh, what do you want? If you wish. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hmm. There they are. It's done, as I thought. Simple. If you wish. Uh, what do you want? If you wish. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hmm. It is done. Alright, so that takes us down to the basement, I believe. As I thought. Simple. Declare yourself. You. What are you doing down here? 
This restricted area. Live immediately or face the consequences. Uh, what's going on down here? What are all these cells? I warned you, fool. Guards. Intruders. Okay, well then let us, uh... Deal with this. What is it now? Okay, now that's been settled. I'll help however I can. You point, I pop. I have had to drop. I shall go forth at your I have command. Only two arms and no more space. Yes. If you wish. There was a gem down here, right? Huh? What do you want? Oh, it's gonna make some cells. Sales, yeah. not cells. Point the sword, and I shall strike. All right, let's go sell this stuff that I found. It is done. As I thought. Simple. If you wish. So I look at all the options there. There might be a way to peacefully stay back there. Uh, but this, the quest we're on isn't gonna end peacefully, regardless. So. I gotta stop dipping into me own ale. So I can't sell the quarter staff. Chainmail's worth a little bit at least. Well, let's drop some of this these arrows and stuff. We don't need these for now. Uh, what do you want? Alright, see if I can talk to Hendek. If you wish. Yes. Why is he... I don't understand the pathing in this game. Not one bit. What? Uh... Uh, this takes, this uh, should take us down to the sewers, I believe, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Well met and welcome. They letting in is the most darling man to, to make this place for us. It is done. Be merry, friend. How do you feel, darling? Hmm. Like I'm ready to float off into the clouds, my love. As I thought. So this is a simple. I assume an opium if den. You wish. Actually, I don't know if opium exists uh, in a. Out with it, huh? Baldur's Gate or not? If you wish. I'm assuming that's what it's supposed to be. A moment, friend. You are obviously not aligned with our captors. Might I know your name? My name is Donald, and I'm certainly not aligned with Letnin and his men. Who are you? I'm Hendek, a proud warrior from the north until my cap until my capture by slavers. I've been imprisoned longer than any of these men and survived, though only barely. I've done what I can to aid these other slaves and keep them living through the battles that Letnin puts on to amuse his noble friends. I beg of you, please free us! I have never begged before, and yet I do it now so I might wreak vengeance on Letnan and end his sick and twisted enterprise. You yeah, have a little taste for it myself. Very well. I'll attempt to free you if I can. I truly hope that you'll be able to, friend. The Beastmaster has the key to ourselves. If you get the key from him, 
we'll be able to escape. I think it's the right thing to do, to free these people. I was once something of a slave myself, locked away in a tiny cage. It, it isn't right. We're going to free this warrior and his people. This is a task of great honor. We shall be great heroes for this. Heroes doing heroic things for all to see. May the gods aid your task. Would that I could help, but I shall have to be content with the hope that Letnin will feel the cold swiftness of my blade. Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah. So I don't know if he what can actually lockpick these. I, I assume that he can. Dance on the head of a pin as well. What? Hmm. It is done. As I thought. Simple. If you wish. Uh, what do you want? If you wish. Hey, what's yeah, a wolf pelt? Yeah. Oh, there's a quest for those in this one. Hmm. It is done. Oh, it's As a panther. I thought. If you wish. I trust all this well. Eh? I recognize you. Who are you? I'm here to free the gladiators from their cells. Hand over the keys. Fool, we never escape here alive. Come, Tabitha. Come. Open the cages. Aid your master. Take care of Tabitha first, then we'll take care of the bears. Yes. A Minotaur. Uh. Alright, so he actually drops a unique bow, if I remember correctly. Swords, not words! What do you want? Yes, if you wish. Alright, stone to flesh. Alright, she has two spells to memorize. What? Let's do that real quick. Yes, Sweet. if you wish. Uh, yeah, yeah. Let's get sell the stuff that I just picked up. I want to make sure that we have space in our inventory for where we're, where we're headed. I also want to identify that bow that we just found, which I think we can do for free. Yeah. Nope, oh, wrong place. Maybe she can. Nope. Okay. So the T Tugan bow? Twigan bow? Let's try to pronounce it. I'm going to say Tugans. Uh, the Tugans are a nomadic people, widely dispersed across the steppe regions of Faerun, but bound together by a common bloodline. Their bows, the bows they make are especially tailored for their mobile warriors, and the process used is carefully guarded, but the result is well known. Any bow of Tugan origin can be fired faster than is possible with a normal one. So yeah, it increases the attack rate. Pretty good for early on. What? And I'll probably be giving that to... Uh, Yoshimo. I think he has short bow proficiency. If he doesn't, then I guess it doesn't matter. Oh yeah, he does. Perfect. I am ready. 
So actually, you grab all of these, buddy. So for now, you'll be using this instead of that. Some cheap beer for ya. Wow. All right, works for me. Oh, yeah, let's rest. If you wish. Actually, let me do a save real quick. I'm not in dialogue mode. Thank you. Uh, there was another... I thought I made another manual save. Uh, let's see. Timer. Timer save. There we go. Just in case something happens where uh, me some nice looking waitresses, don't I? <laughs> All right, let's sleep. Stand. You rest each night uneasy. Yes, you are weary. You struggle daily. It will not end, you know, until you acknowledge what you are. You walk as a mortal taking no advantage from your heritage, from your talents within. So many things of flesh are greater than you. Walk among them, these beasts that are less than you are. See their strength, see how easily you fall to their muscle and skill. Why do you stand for this? Why do you submit to the flesh when death is bred in your bones? Do you realize the power you might hold? When the world of flesh is beneath you, even creatures mysterious and magical will fall. Gift you are owed by the blood in your veins. I just realized we're in Candlekeep. Follow, if only to protect the weak that fell because of you. Yes, it is done. All right, let's go talk to Hendak and release him. Simple. But that's not it for the quest. There's still more to be done through the sewers. If you wish. You have the key! You have it! Thank the gods! And thank you truly, my friend, for what you have done. We are free, my brothers! Go now and free the women! Hendak will strike his blade into the heart of our so-called owner, so that he shall never trouble you again. Go and savor your freedom. Praise be, we are free, free at last. Thank you again, my friends. Now, to the task of killing that fiend Leighton. Assist me if you wish. Otherwise, stand and watch the vengeance of Hendak be fulfilled. Run, run, the slaves have escaped. Oh, run for your lives! They'll kill us for certain! What? Huh? Yes, they will. What do you want? If you wish. Uh. Alright, let's follow him back and yeah, help yeah. him deal with Letnan. Letnan. Hmm. It is done, as I thought. Go for the eyes! Go for the eyes! Yeah! 
You slaving bastard. My family's blood still stains your hands. Simple. Animan, where are you going, buddy? If you wish. Alright, we're gonna have a lot of loot again. Very well. Yes. You point where Minsk goes, evil stands uh -huh. aside. I am only back there. Forth at your command. Yes. Must have missed that. Point the sword, and I shall strike. Sweet, another spell to memorize. What do you want? I mean, it's more experience. I can't carry no more. Yeah, yeah. Mince and what? Hendak, you ignorant barbaric slave! You're behind all of this chaos, aren't you? I'll take it out of your hide. Enough, fiend. You no longer own me. And I'll ensure that you no longer claim ownership over any other as well. I've survived your hellish fighting pit for years. You are the match for me. We shall see. Yes. Every hamster, jump on my sword while you can, evil. What? I won't be as gentle. I I No more. Your item is on the ground. Oh, that's a good chunk of change. Armor, live by the sword. Live a good long time. All the years of cruel and evil acts that you have committed for nothing more than coins in your pocket. Burn in the abyss, fiend. I really have. Uh, Minsk is like the only, only one who does it. He keeps screaming over NPC dialogue when they start when it's voice acted. I owe you my thanks once again. Uh, as do all those you have freed. I intend to take this place as payment for my slavery, to ensure it is never used as such again. I wish I did not have to ask, but there is one more task that needs doing. The slavers remain at large at the Nathkatla, hidden at their base here in the slums. They have many children, yet that they retain as slaves. I would ask of you to rid the city of this infestation once and for all. More slavers in the city? Very well. We shall do what we can. I knew you would not let me down. The compound is not far from here. A dry docked boat just across the way on the east side of the slums. It may be risky to approach openly. There was talk of a secret passage to the sewer connecting the coronet to the slaver base, but I do not know where it might be. I know nothing of the defenses of the place inside, however. My stay there was brief and very long ago. More children kept as slaves? Boo is outraged by the evil that leaps about this city, like a hot-footed weasel. We must save the children, Donald. We must. Ah, a chance to strike at the heart of slavery here in Athkala. Think of it, Donald. You can make a difference if you wish. At least for a while. Take on the slavers themselves? On their home ground? I don't know. Do it if you must, Donald. But don't think it will be easy. Good fortune to you, my friend. Alright, oh, so she has some new spells to memorize. I actually catch what level level six spell. Okay. I don't have any level 6 spells yet. Yes. Okay. Let's do some selling. Who says? What? I have had to drop what you gave me. I hear you. I have well only enough. two arms and no more space. What? Hmm. Let's talk to Bernard. You want some whiskey? Uh, since Hendak has promised us a discount, I'd like to see what you have on tap here. Make sure that we get that discount, though. All 
I need to get rid of those darts. What can I do? Because huh? I'm never going to use those. You point, yes. I punch. It is done. Hey, actually, let's see if we can talk to Hennick about I anything thought. else real quick. Let me get head towards the sewers. Simple. I will always be grateful for your assistance. Alright, uh, good to see- Ah, oh, bleh, bleh, I can't talk. Ah, good to see you again, of course, my friend. How may Hendak be of assistance? I was wondering if you could tell me again about the slave compound you mentioned. Well, as I said, the slavers remain at large within Athkatla, and at their base here in the slums. They have many children that are still enslaved. Alright, we've already read that. I see. Well, I shall have to think on this. Can I see your services in the meantime? It's not as much as the fee that had, but it's plenty, and it's at a significant discount for you. Just speak to Bernard. I still have him handling the store. What? I'm creeping on the uh, on the waitresses. Uh. Out with it, if you wish. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Alright, I'm going to call it here. In the next episode, we will explore the sewers. There's a couple of neat things to do down here. Um, yeah, yeah. I hope I remember how to do it. I don't think there's like a puzzle. I think it's just you collect items to solve a, solve a puzzle. It's not like... It's not complicated. I hope. But yeah, we're going to find something really neat down here. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next episode. Sorry, I keep losing my train of thought this episode. It's just, I'm all over the place. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next one.